there was this shopkeeper who um, who was kind of not busy, and he had this shop where he had some um, workers, some people working for him. He had about three people who used to work for him, or who are working for him, rather. And um, he closes about five o'clock every evening, but this day, about half past four, he thought to himself, do you know what, things are really slow here. So you guys, why don't you knock off, go home, and I will do the rest myself. I will stay here for the next half hour, and then um, I will close up. So about 10 minutes later, a dog walked into his shop. Now this dog had um, a bag in his mouth. <clears throat> the dog made sure that the shop owner got his attention. And um, the guy, out of curiosity, looked into the bag, and there was a piece of paper in this bag. Now he opened up the piece of paper, and it read, you know, it had a list of, of, of um, stuff that, he had some items on it, like soap, um, cream, and all that stuff. And then he had some money as well. So um, the man took all what was on the list, put it in a bag, and gave it back to the dog. And then the dog um, walked out of the shop. Now the guy got curious. This must be a fantastic dog. I mean, a dog that came shopping. A dog that is turning into a woman. So basically, what he did, he closed up his shop quickly, and he decided to and follow the dog, see where the dog was going. Now the dog got to the bus stop, or to a bus stop, and he waited for a minute. A bus came, he climbed in. <laughs> and um, this, um, the, 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 the shop owner went into the bus as well, got into the bus as well. Now about three stops later, the, bus, um, the dog came out of the bus, and the guy out of curiosity wanted to know where this dog was going. So he kept on following the dog, until the dog got to a house. Now he got to this house and he stood right in front of the front door for a few seconds. Then what he did, he put the bag down, he went back, and then he threw itself against the door. Now that was his way of knocking the door. So that the first time, nothing happened. He did it the second time, nothing happened. He did it the third time, nothing happened. So the dog went to the side of the house and did the same thing. Now after about a minute or two, this guy came out of the door. Now you can see that this guy was really angry. He had his cigarette in his mouth. He had a big belly, half covered with his um, singlets or t-shirts or whatever. And he stood there. And he was showing the dog a sign with his hand, showing the dog that the dog was number one. You're number one, you know? And you could see that there was a lot of obscenity coming from the man's mouth. He was basically angry. So, the, um, the man who was hiding came out from where he was hiding. He went, to the dog, he went to the dog owner and said, excuse me, sir, why are you shouting at this dog? This is a fantastic dog. A dog that came shopping in my shop and has brought his groceries back to you needs to be commended and not shouted at. And the man looked at him and said, man, are you telling me this dog is clever? The guy said, yeah. Then he laughed. How can this dog be clever? This is the second time in one week that this silly dog has forgotten his keys. <laughs> now let's look, at, let's look at it this way. Now, I don't know what you do. I don't know what you do in your private life or working life. But I'm sure sometimes you tell yourself that you're not being appreciated. Sometimes, it might even be in your marriage, you might tell yourself, you know what, I'm not really being appreciated here. But look at the pain that that guy took following the dog all through until he got to his front house. There are a lot of people who are watching you and following you, appreciating everything that you do. The man or woman that you expect to say thank you might not necessarily say it, but there are lots of people who are loving you for what you're doing. What I want to do today is I encourage you to continue to do what you're doing because there's somebody out there who is loving you and appreciating you and following you to wherever you're going to just because of what you're doing. Enjoy the rest of the show and thank you.